Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Cancers. So this is going to be your daily reading for your general energies and also for your love energies, Cancers. So let's see what's coming up for your general energies first before we move on to your love energies, guys. Let's see what's coming up. We have the Sun, King of Wands, the Lovers, the Three of Wands. Okay, so you might be falling in love today, guys. That's what I see here. You might be falling in love with someone. Okay, so that's what I say. That's what I see here for most of you. So you like someone and. You're going to like view or like what to say explain this person that you really like them and you're going to like fall in love with someone new might also be you're also like some of you are in this what to say you are just in this painful energy because you just came out of a traumatic situation you don't know how to deal with the situation still so you're just like juggling between the too many things and you're just like in this what is same you don't know if you're happy you're sad if you're sad you're happy you're confused between happy and sad energies and all of that okay you're just into this confusion you guys also want to what is say guard the people that you love and you're scared that you'll fail guarding the people that you love most of you okay i also see here that you're looking back at your past and you're just wondering how stupid you've been or just looking at the past and you're just wondering how did the situation turn out to be like this and you don't know you have no clue how it turned out to be like this you're also like creating a lot of loved connections with people you're creating a new bond with people around you might also be the case for most of you guys okay so you're practicing a lot of things today maybe modeling maybe like cooking or you're just doing a lot of things today okay you also will be voicing out your thoughts to people around you that people will be really what to say really happy that you've at least telling them that how you feel about them right now and You'll just make people happy today. That's what I see here, Cancers. So let's see what else is coming up for your love energies, guys. What is coming up for your love energies? We have the Nine of Cups. We have the Eight of Wands. We have the Seven of Swords. We have the Ace of Cups. And the Six of Pentacles. Oh my God. Okay. So with these cards, I really feel like you guys are like, what to say? You guys want to do something new for yourselves. You just want to make things right. You just want this relationship to grow more. You just want your person to stay with you all the time okay but i also see here that you're dealing with a lot of things at this moment you're just also being hurted you don't know what to do because we have the ace of cups you have this filled cup of love that is ready like you can give this to anyone whomever you wish to but then at the same time you doubt giving it to people and at the same time you don't want to give it but you actually think of giving the love to people around you, okay? 
it might be like you want to give love but then you're hesitant to give love to people because you've already had a heartbreak and you don't know whether if you give this love to someone will you don't know whether they'll be able to keep the promise or they'll be able to stay with you forever with the nine of cups the same kind of energy that i'm getting guys you guys are like into the cycle again you guys are like rolling over and over again you don't actually know what you're doing or you're just kind of sad with whatever you're doing that's what i see here most of you are not happy with the situation that you're dealing with you're kind of like thinking about the memories again and again it's just coming like a flash bulb memory to you all it's just like suddenly appearing and suddenly vanishing and you're just like oh my god was i even in that situation and you're just kind of sad guys right now cancers you just want this freedom that you've been wanting for a long time and you would do whatever it takes to have this energy in your lives okay that's what i see here so you just want this person is to also come back to you as soon as possible okay but your person i see here is dealing with a lot of sadness a lot of things in their lives whether it be in career wise whether it be financial traumatic situation whether it be family situation they're dealing with a lot of things okay let's just see what your person is doing right now today and how are they even thinking about you okay or thinking about this connection and what would they want to do okay your person what are they actually thinking Okay guys, with the Ten of Cups, definitely this person is kind of like thinking to be with you forever. But right now, as I told before, this person is in this devil energy. They have a lot of addictions that they are facing right now. I don't know, this person is kind of like not like how you expected them to be or they're like kind of worse. They're not in a good energy. They feel trapped in their fears. They feel like whatever they're trying to manifest is not manifesting eventually. And they feel really in this traumatic vibe, guys. That's what I see here for most of you. Your person is kind of like not in the vibe that you would want them to be. They're definitely not in the vibration that they are supposed to be in because they're trapped in their fears. They're like, what is it? They're scared to do whatever they're doing right now. They're just scared for every way, like every I mean, every step they're taking in their lives, they're kind of sad. And that is not really helping them to grow. Also, I see that, okay? So whatever they're doing right now, they're not growing. They're sad. They're depressed. They don't know what they're doing. And they, most of all, are like really in this negative vibe. And they really feel bad of being in that negative energy, but they don't know what to do about it, okay? They cannot do anything about being in this negative energy that's what i see here for most of them okay guys so let's see what signs you are probably dealing with guys okay let's just see what are the signs you might be dealing with cancers so you could be dealing with any signs it's just uh, to give you a clear outlook okay you could be dealing with any sign okay it doesn't matter but it's just like what to say it's just a deeper insight so that if you're dealing with these signs and definitely this is a reading for you but generally it is a reading for uh, my scorpio i mean my cancers okay you might be also dealing with scorpio okay guys so let's see what are the signs you're probably dealing with so what are the signs We have the moon again, Scorpios, I see strong Scorpios. What are the signs you're dealing with? You might be dealing with the Scorpio Cancer Pisces, you might be dealing with um, Pisces, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or you're also dealing with a Taurus Virgo Capricorn. 
strong leo sagittarius cancers i also see here okay cancer energy scorpio energy pisces i see the most then i see the taurus sagittarius aquarius libra gemini the most okay so you might be dealing with any of these signs mostly okay but i don't really know what are the signs you probably are dealing with but these are the signs mostly i see here guys okay so with these cards i also see a strong uh, energy that this person is coming towards you they want to come towards you okay but they're dealing with a lot of traumatic condition traumatic situation in their lives but they will definitely come towards you so that's what i see here for my lovely cancers thank you so much guys for all of your support please keep supporting me your lucky color for today is blue and your lucky crystal for today is how light bye i see you all tomorrow